Hello, my 3D printer peeps. I'm here with the Bamboo Lab X1C, and today we are going to replace the extruder. Break out your Allen key or similar tools, and let's get started. Before working with the tool head or hot end, it's a good idea to retract the filament. Simply touch the filament icon, choose the filament you have loaded, and touch unload. That will heat the hot end and retract the filament from the tool head. It's likely there is still filament in your nozzle. That's okay, you may proceed. Be careful when removing the tool head. Unlike the P1 series, the connector for this tool head is on the inside of the cover, not the circuit board. The tool head is magnetic. Simply pull it forward. You may rest the tool head on the bars. To remove the extruder, we will first remove the PTFE tube. To remove the PTFE tube, pinch it up here. Depress this assembly so that the ring above the coupler is depressed and simply remove the tube. Pulling on the tube without depressing this assembly will break the PTFE coupler. Go ahead and remove all four connections seen here. With all four connections removed, you will remove this screw, this screw, and this screw. With all three screws removed, loosen this screw on the cutter arm until you can remove the blade away from the extruder. With the cutter out of the way and all screws removed, grab the hot end and work the extruder off. To remove your hot end, remove these two screws right here. With the screws removed, simply pinch the hot end and slide it off. You now have the X1C hot end and the X1C extruder separated. To install the new extruder, we will simply do things in reverse order. Take the new extruder, take your hot end, position it with the wires facing the left and simply slide it up onto the extruder. With the hot end and extruder back together, go ahead and slide it into place. Reinstall three screws here, here, and here. Then replace the cutter by flipping the blade forward and pushing it upward until it slips into place in the extruder. Tighten this scrub while holding the cutter. There you go. Replace all four cables carefully. With all cables carefully replaced, take your tool head cover, use the magnets to pop it back on. And there you have it. We have successfully replaced our X1C extruder. I'm Mr. Greg. This is the X1C, and you're on 3D Rundown.